What's up guys? We're back at it again. We're gonna go down to the lake, see if we can catch a few. So I'm gonna try to just target some bass today. Um if I don't catch any bass, might just lighten the tackle, catch something small. We'll see how it goes. It's a little chilly out there. We got a cold front that came through. So anyways. Fishing might be tough today, but I'll see y'all down at the lake. All right, we're down here at the lake. I already made a few casts with the rooster tail and now I got a crankbait on. We're gonna see if we can get one, but it, it's tough. Um, it's like 31 degrees outside, but we'll get at it. We'll see if we can catch one today. Water's finally at full capacity. We had uh, some rain come through. This is what the lake looks at like when it's at 100%. We'll see if we can get one. I think I got one. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, baby. There we go. Oh yeah. On the crankbait. I think that'd be a keeper if we was fishing a tournament. Let's get a measurement on them. <clears throat> All right. Oh, he's just just shy of 15. He's 14 and a half, guys. 14 and a half inches. They gotta be 15. But I am just so happy to get that bite. Let's go. All right, let's go. Let's get back out there. They're hitting the crank bait. I see a fish swimming in there. I see the ripples. Let's see if he'll bite this. Dang, snagged again. I broke off, dang it. I did not want that to happen. No, no, that bait was doing so good for me. We broke off. It was 
just a typical like white crankbait with black top like that that combination gets me more boats than any other thing when throwing crankbaits white top i mean <laughs> white crankbait with black top kind of like this uh here I got a jerk bait here the color combination is really similar to this dang i did not want to break off i'm gonna try something different i'll see y'all again soon all right guys i'm back the only other color i i think i i had that might work Where we at? right here we got a green top that's like white on the sides but it'll still have that little color difference when choosing crankbaits guys the main thing is to have different color like a, a different color on top and a different color on sides that way when it's moving through the water the fish see the flashing like that i like the black top with with the white sides but we're gonna try this green top because it's it's all i have right now so we'll get back at it guys Hopefully we don't lose this one. I've lost a lot of crankbaits over the years. Oh. oh I'm snagged again. Oh man. I thought that was a fish. Oh, got it, got it unsnagged, but dang. It's the only bad thing about fishing with crankbaits. When you get them snagged, it, sometimes it's very tough to get them, get them loose again, but hopefully we don't lose this one. Make a few more casts. If we don't catch nothing, we'll go back to the old rooster tail. Or maybe a spinner bait, something like that. We'll change it up. I also got a jerk bait we could try. Kind of just fishing into the wind that way. I can make longer casts, you know, and the wind's blowing this way. I will be buying a bait caster eventually. There's a nice Abu Garcia bait caster I want it. Walmart combo rod reel, medium heavy, seven foot. It's like $75. So that's gonna be my next my next big purchase when it comes to fishing and hopefully I can get that before I fish my first tournament. Cause really you're you want a, you want a you know, bait caster when when cranking. But if all you got's a spinner bait or if all you got's a spinning combo, use what you got and that's what I got, so and thought we were snagged again, but we got it done. We got it undone. If you're ever dealing with some wind cast into the wind that way you can get longer casting you know what i'm saying that's if you're fishing out open water and you want to get a longer cast in
Caught a stick. A tree pounder. Be honest with you guys, it's cold out here to be fishing. I think I'm just gonna wrap this trip up. Um, I'm just gonna consider this my outro, guys, because I'm getting cold being out here too long. I don't want to catch hypothermia. I hope you enjoyed the fish that I did catch. We're gonna come back out when the warmer when the weather gets warmer. But yeah, I'm, I'm just trying to put some time in, get some more experience, you know, get, you know, you're never going to become a good fisherman if you don't put the time in. This is just a little practice session. And now that I'm doing YouTube, another little video that I made for you guys. And I did catch a fish. So 14 and a half incher, not quite a keeper. If it was just a half, in, a half an inch longer, we could have kept it but hope you guys have a good one keep fishing never stop just like john b says see y'all